Hello everybody, it's me, Nate, a.k.a. Devil Dog, here with my cameraman. Dead Man Bones. And we're here for the 2022 Dayton Ale Trail, and we're starting at the first place we always do each time, at the Lucky Star Cantina. So let's go in here, and let's do this. Yes, let's do it, it's cold. Much like every other year we've been here, we start off at the Lucky Star Cantina, and I always try something new. This time I'm trying something called a chill pill. It's pretty much your classic pills. So let's check this out. Yeah. Do you have dead man bones? I got a crane mango. It's a mango shin. We're here at the second stop, back at Star City Brewing, and I'm trying something different called Berry Cherry. It's a jelly donut ale. Let's try it. Wow, this is really good. <laughs> I'm up here at our stomping grounds at Aomatic with the rest of the guys, and I got here, I think it's called the New American Classic. It's a uh, really hop heavy IPA. Say goodbye to the beer. <laughs> hey man, what are you having? Raspberry Love Stone. Good stuff. Yeah. All right, Dead Man Bones, what are you having today? It's dark and it's hell is hot. It's dark and hell is hot. Uh, I am having the Mimosa Goose, the, uh, the Santana Kerbal. The Santana Chump. Mm -hmm. And just get on. <laughs> ding, ding, ding. Thank you, you need to try this. This is great stuff. I'll pay you. Okay. Come on, get in focus. Good old hydrometer. Best. All right, I'm here at the Carillon Brewing, and this time I tried to get something different. I got something known as a coriander. It's a spiced beer. Let's try it out. Ooh, wow. That's got a lot of flavor to it. Hello, ginger pale. Ginger pale. Ginger pale, more like ginger gone. Oh. Ding, 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 ding. 18 bucks for the glass. Look at that 15. glass. That's a nice glass. 15. How much? 15? Yes. And what'd you get? You got the same thing as him? Yes. Go ahead and take a sip of that and let me know what it tastes like. Oh, wow. That, that's heavy on the ginger. It goes well. What you got, bro? Uh, Nate? And he just slammed it before he could even tell me what he had, pal. So what in the world did you just slam, bro? Today I'm having the deep sea diving. Let's say about the diving meat. 
What about you, my friend? What do you got? I am having the Thomas Hoppy Lager. Hoppy Lager! Which is weird hop since Hop Lager usually is a Hop forward. But apparently they put dry hops in this sucker. Here we go. Okay, that is very good. So, Another one. All right, I'm at lot 27, and I'm trying something known as a dirty bean stout. You know what? I'm assuming it has coffee and stout in it. Let's try this. Oh, you're not gonna believe this. I told you. Whoa! Oh my god. Yo, you gotta try this. This is amazing. Alright, what you have? I'm getting the lock tender, a golden ale. Getting the lock tender, more like he done busted that lock, cause that stuff is gone. As usual. Holy crap. <laughs> We're here at the Toxic Brew Company. Let's see what they have. Oh, I'm trying to find out how to spawn gun. Okay, I am here at Toxic Brew and I am trying something known as the OK Karen. Let's see if this has any sort of problems with people recording it or not. Huh. This is the first Karen I can say I agree with. <laughs> right, what did you get, man? I'm always small today on the Hangar 18. Ain't nothing wrong with that, man. And it's gone. Okay, what did you get since this is an ale trail, but you got something different? I got the Jolly Dickens. That's hot spice cider with cinnamon savage and apple rum. Apple rum and cinnamon? Oh, that sounds uh, quite uh, yuletide. Yeah, it does. Uh, go ahead, like, drink this. Ooh, that is delicious. All right, now we're at Branch and Boom. and bone this place is popping which is good to see people again i am doing something that is known as the unmasks let's see how this good thing is what you got i got the berry bomb it's sour i didn't get the abv I think it's at least five. I have the Gnome Enthusiast, a German Pilsner. Alright, we're here now at Miller Brew Bar. Oh yeah! of uh, awards, but I can't say I've ever been in a place that has voted best, second place for best bar bathroom. 
All right, we are here at Bach, and I am trying something known as the Reaper. It is a black wheat. Let's try this. Looks right up my alley because I'm a mud man, like we all know. Thank you. Oh, oh wow! Now we're tapping out. Huh? I got the twisted alt. It's an alt beer brewed with salt pretzels. Brewed with salt pretzels? Yep. I'll go ahead and try that. I'm intrigued by this one. Can you taste the pretzels? All right, we are here at Heavier Than Air Brewing, and I'm trying something known as a McCook Barrel. This is a stout that is a gold medal winner. Let's try this bad boy. It's got some bite to it. Get me away from this, this caused me problems. All right, now we're here at Loose Ends and I'm trying something that is known as a B-Man's Lager. It is an American Light Lager. Let's try this bad boy out. Wow. That is a super smooth, super smooth, mega smooth light lager. This one right here, you want to take this thing to a ball game and it'll go down quick with a chili dog. Oh yeah. Nowhere in particular. Cabinet. All right, we are here at Nowhere in Particular and I'm having something called a Pandemic IPA. Let's hope I don't have to get a test after I drink this. Yes, I see what you're saying. Beer is like choking. Wine is like choking. Whoa! It's almost citrusy like grapefruit. It's really good. And what do you have? Lazy Bean Science Team. It's an IPA with citra and very. And yes, there's going to be a lot of heavy editing on this because they're playing Def Leppard. I can't have that playing. It'll get copyrighted. <laughs> Eudora and I'm trying something known as an experimental. Let's see if it drives me crazy or not. Oh. I'll admit, I don't like this. I got a sunflower blonde ale, so I think Miles Morales would agree to this were he of age. We are here at the Wandering Griffin, and I got myself, last year I got the same thing, but she said this is different. It's a gingerbread imperial stout. Last year's version wasn't an imperial stout, it was just a stout. So let's see if it's really different. Ooh, this one is a lot better. Really good. What did you get, man? Hunky Dory Apple. It's a cider. Well, of course it's an apple cider. It's a uh, spice. Ooh. Okay. Next up, we're at Southern Ohio Brewing. I got something called a Private Idaho. I wonder if that means it's going to taste like a potato. Supposedly it's an IPA. It smells good. Mm. 
Not a bad IPA at all. Pretty tasty. 818 Cream Ale. All right, well, take yourself a big drink of that. Cream, get the money. Dollar, dollar bills, no. Dollar, dollar bills, no. Wrong place. Here at Yellow Springs Brewery, and I'm trying something known as piece of cake. It's a German chocolate cake stout. Oh wow! Can kind of get the burn from it though. I do feel that, but other than that, very good rendition of a German chocolate cake because you know it's got coconuts in it, right? All right, Dead Man Bones, what are you having this time? Captain Stardust, it's a saison. Oh, really? I'm surprised you didn't go for the double boat show. Maybe next time, right? <laughs> All right, now we're here at Trail Town Brewing, the second location out in the third location here. I got something that is known as the Trail Town. Let's see here. Dead Man Bones, what did you get here? Well, I got my beer hard, I like my coffee. A cream and two sugars. It's called cream and two sugars, huh? Yeah, and uh, it's an 8.1, and that's radical for a cream ale. Yeah. There's a coffee note in that. Bruh. Okay, we're up here at Rolling Mills and I am having something known as a hollow hayride. It's an Imperial Pumpkin Ale. 8.7 by the way. Good flavor, smooth. Oh man. All right. <laughs> All right, Dead Man Bones, what are you having this time? 10 0 9, fail start. We are up here at Fig Leaf, and I'm having a Valraven Chocolate Cherry Stout. A 7.5 Milk Stout. Gee, I wonder if I'm gonna like this or not. Of course you're gonna like it, it's a freaking stout. And it's you. Tastes like a chocolate covered cherry. <laughs> All right, dead man, what are you having? The Astra. Baja Blast off part of seltzer. What, a Baja Blast version of a seltzer? That's crazy. Do you want tacos now? Okay, we're here up at Crooked Handle. And this time I'm having something called a Bombs Away. Wow, dude, this has got some really good floral notes to it. Pretentious Barrel House Anniversary, it's a sour 5.8 ABV. It's a Barrel House Anniversary, that's a shame since they went under. <laughs> Okay, we are here up at Warped Wing, and I am having something known 
as a Baltic Porter Applejack Whiskey BA. Smells good. I can smell it from here. Oh, wow. That is his last name, Baruchus. Does it pity the fool? Whoa! No, this kicks the fool's butt. Okay. It may be snowing, but we're here at Devil Wind. Okay, next we're here at Devil Wind, and I'm having something known as a Night Stalker. Ah, this thing here is a bourbon barrel aged stout. Who would have guessed I went with it for a stout, right? <laughs> Next up, we're here at Mother Stewart's Brewing, and I'm having something known as a disco dancer. It is a hazy IPA. Let's try this bad boy out. Man, every place on my trip has turned out to have great, fantastic beer. Yeah. That's a truck stop. It's pills. Truck stop Pilsner. It's a Pilsner, baby. Hmm. All right, I'm here at Hairless Hair Brewery. I'm having myself another Imperial Stout because that's just how I roll. Delicious. All right, how about you? Sweet cherry pie. Finally, after all these years, we are finally allowed here at Fifth Street Brewing. Yeah. Yep. Long Shadow Saison. Long Shadow Saison. All right. I have to add, this is the first time we've actually been in the film here that they actually allow us. Ooh. Oh, you like it. All right. I'm actually able to film here after three years. This is a JoJo Stout. This actually is a JoJo Midnight Stout. Let's check this bad boy out. Oh! Oh wow, hey, this is a yeah. good stout. Uh, All right, we're here at New Ales and I'm having a Wonder Twins Power Activate! <laughs> a deeper. Got the Enjoy Young Mimosa single IPA this time around. Not a double like someone's Wonder Twin Power Air to activate. And that's the 2022 Dayton Ale Trail, where we tackled and beat 28 different breweries in a total time of less than four hours. Now here's the prize we got. What's your favorite location that we went to on the Dayton Hale Trail 2022? And remember, here at Devil Dog Gaming, we always like to end our videos by saying, have fun, play hard, and remember, people, the devil is in the details. Peace out till next time. Cheers, mates. Yeah.